The overall goal of the following experiment is to screen for and characterize phage genes with unknown functions. First, putative phage viral open reading frames, called ORFs, are expressed in E. coli. Clones of the phage ORF expressing E. coli are inoculated into multi-phenotype assay plates, or MAPs, which contain growth medium and various substrates. Bacterial growth is then monitored over time by spectrophotometry. As a second method of analysis, phage gene expressing E. coli are grown in either continuous culture or by serial batch culturing. The resulting growth metabolites are then collected and sent for metabolomic analysis by gas chromatography time-of-flight mass spectrometry. The resulting data offers a phenotypic profile associated with expression of a single putative phage open reading frame. This method was initially developed to elucidate the function of unknown viral proteins. It can also be applied to studies looking at the link between genotypes and phenotypes and in examining the interactions between bacteriophage and host across biomes. Begin this procedure by labeling sterile 96-well microtiter plates with the E. coli clone identification number and MAP schematic type which indicates the substrates that are being tested against in the assay. Aseptically transfer sterile water into a liquid reservoir. Then, using a multi-channel pipette, transfer 60 microliters of water into each well of the microtiter plate. Next, aseptically transfer 3x basal medium into a liquid reservoir. Then, using a multi-channel pipetter, transfer 50 microliters into each well of the microtiter plate. Using the same technique,